Hi, my name is Jessica Watley, and this is why you should hire me. What is your background? I have been self-employed as a freelance writer for several years. My writing experience consists of a few published books, either on Smashwords or Lulu.com. My education consists of an associate's degree in criminal justice, specifically criminal investigations, and a bachelor's, bachelor's degree in creative writing for entertainment. What has inspired you to want to work in the entertainment field? Actually, when I was younger, I got to see how movies were made in at Hollywood Studios. And I also was taken behind the scenes of a few movies that were being made. And I actually thought it was pretty cool how they were made entirely. So, that really was what really wanted me to work in the entertainment field, you know, read screenplays, and what have you. Especially when sometimes the screenplays are not as good as the actual movies. What central event in your life has helped shape you the most? That would have to be the death of my grandmother and my uncles. My grandmother died several years ago, and my uncles died both three and four years ago. And if it wasn't for them, I probably wouldn't be here today. And I first got my degree um, because that's what my grandmother wanted me to do, was get one in either criminal justice or criminal investigations, which I did. And when my uncles died, I basically just said, you know what, I'm going to either go into psychology or I'm going to actually get in creative writing. Even though, honestly, I almost want to go back to get my degree in criminal investigations, or at least criminal justice to finish my education there. Where do you see yourself in five years? Preferably written a few more books, maybe finished a couple of my screenplays. That's basically where I want to be. If not, I probably would be looking into or trying to finish uh, one of my degrees, preferably in uh, criminal justice, perhaps even volunteering at the local police station, or going on ride-alongs. How would you handle conflict with someone in a professional setting? Well, I used to be a guild master, so conflict happens a lot. You basically need a cool head, and you need to listen to everybody's point of view. That's basically it. Would you lie for your boss if they asked you to? Honestly, it depends. Probably not, if you want to be completely honest. But your boss is the person you work for. You're not there to make friends with them. You're not there to know them. You're there to work. And I've tried explaining this to people before, but your boss is the person that pays you. You do not need to know them personally. But quite honestly, if they did ask me to lie, it would honestly be a massive character breach. And I probably would not lie for them. Thank you very much.